Hi, my name is Matt Rathel. I'm a studio director for Graphite Lab, and I'm also an adjunct professor of art and design at Maryville University. Well, our approach as a studio um, is very much trying to build mutually beneficial relationships with universities. Um, so where possible, if we can be involved in some of that educational process, uh, especially as it relates to games, uh, and then also universities a way to get their students more quickly acclimated to the professional world, I see that as a, as a great benefit then. Um, at Graphite Lab, we um, started off making mock-ups for games for the client to see how the flow would go. Uh, we also did just small uh, art assets for the games that were in progress, animations. Um, we worked on game trailers and we actually ended up making our own original property. So the app that we were working on while we were there was called Monster Match and basically it's just a general matching game but it's all kind of skinned out in monsters. It's basically there to help kids learn their alphabet and be able to match from like A and A and, and learning letters while at the same time um, having a fun kind of interactive experience with um, the monsters and everything like that. It's a very different scenario of developing art in an academic setting versus developing art in a professional setting. There's a lot more, uh, there are many more minds and many more opinions that go into the production of a final piece versus it just coming from a single artist in a classroom setting. So in the academic setting uh, I think it's uh, it's great to have that foundation and then we can hopefully expose them to a different side of how that works um, through the professional setting within uh, the studio. My favorite part was probably coming up with all the sketches for our monsters in the game and um, we just had a lot of fun figuring out what they were going to look like. So we had ridiculous monsters that were bending over backwards to make these obnoxious letters that I love. And so to be put into that like collaborative process and say here's three art people and here's a programmer it's like this is the, come up with a concept and make an application. We had a pretty final version and then they tweaked it a little bit so that it would fit onto the App Store and everything. And so now it's actually selling on the App Store, it's being reviewed by websites and it's on the Android marketplace and all kinds of things like that. So it's pretty cool to have something that you made and like our names are in the credits that you could go out and just download right now and see it on there. So it's pretty cool.